Welcome back to my tutorial. First of all, this tutorial is made in Swift 4 on Xcode 9, but if you are still using Swift 3, then this code will work fine for you. Today, we will learn how to set custom annotation pin on map view. So, this is the map view I have. I don't know, it's somehow very slow on iPhone X. So, let's get started. First of all, we will need a icon and coordinates. So, here uh, I opened this flat icon. It's amazing website for downloading like free icons. You just need to credit the author. So uh, let's use this one. I like this icon. Let's view it. Close it. And I'll download it as PNG 5 and 2. And here is the like author. I don't know. Who, yeah, it's by free pick. So amazing author. Uh, don't forget to credit him if you download this or use it anyway. Anyways, I'm downloading it and a uh, link to the flat icon will be in the description so here i have it i'll just send it to desktop and for coordinates uh, i went to google and just typed in taj mahal coordinates and i'll uh, select this website which is latlong.net and open it in new tab so these are the coordinates uh, we will be using it just uh, for now here i have already created a new project so under assets i will just transfer my icon so here is my icon it's named Taj dash uh, make sure uh, you remember the icon name so it's Taj dash Mahal so let's get started first of all uh, we need to create a simple pin uh, first of all we need a map view so let's drag and drop a map view and I will change it to iPhone X and okay here is the map view I'll just extend it okay and constraints zero 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 and zero and hit enter and now let's just connect this and this will be a map view map view that's it uh, if you notice we will be getting an error because we need to import a map kit so import map kit so first of all let's do the normal pin so let's get rid of this and this okay so uh, first of all uh, let's uh, set region to our coordinate so map view dot set region and we need this one with uh, region and animated so animated will be true but for region as you can see we need mk coordinate region so let region is equal to mk coordinate region and open brackets uh, okay we need mk coordinate region i guess yeah make with distance okay make with distance so this will be our coordinates uh, and this latitude meters are the like how much zoomed out you want so i like thousand and uh, thousand from longitude as well so let's create coordinates let co coordinate is equal to it will be cll location coordinate 2d and open parenthesis latitude and longitude uh, this is something we will get from our website so this is 20 uh, la uh, it's always like latitude comma longitude so first one is always latitude so just uh, copy this command c and paste it over here and let's take the longitude and this part is the longitude copy and paste it over here and uh, in the region just replace this by coordinate and this by region and now we need to create an annotation pin like if we just run this application it will just set its region to Taj Mahal but we won't see a pin so for pin we need to create a custom class file so new file a swift file and just say um, annotation annotation pin and hit enter we don't need a foundation kit we need map kit so just change it to map kit and here we will say class Make sure you always name your class same as your file name. So it will be annotation pin. And uh, yeah, uh, it will be inherited from NS object class. And we will abide by the protocol <coughs> MK annotation. Uh, I guess it's this. Yeah, it's a protocol. And if you just like command click and jump to definition, uh, this three uh, 
coordinate is something compulsory and these two are optional but like we need title anyways so we will just uh, use each and every uh, variable so title and if you just start typing sub and you will see the suggestion so just hit enter variable coordinate hit enter and we now need to initialize it so I uh, use this one swift initializer and this will be title uh, string comma subtitle and this will be string as well and we need coordinates and this will be CLL location coordinate okay and hit tab and it will be just like self dot title equal to title self dot subtitle equal to subtitle and self dot coordinate equal to coordinate so I guess that's it just hit command save I guess and it's done uh, so in the view controller we will just say uh, let's create a variable so variable pin uh, it will be of our like class file we just created so it will be annotation pin and exclamation mark so this excla uh, exclamation mark means that we will definitely give this variable a value okay so let's say pin is equal to annotation pin and open back open brackets title will be Taj Mahal and for sub, uh, subtitle let's say greatest let's say one of the one of the wonder of the world and coordinates will be same as above so just say coordinate and we need to add this pin so map view dot add annotation and here just pass in the pin so pin is this pin okay so let's run the application uh, yeah this one is my previous application so don't mind this one is installing and uh, i don't know somehow like map uh, are like loading really slow on iphone x uh, in the simulator i i don't know about the real device so here we can see the pin it's all pin comes always like pin comes first then the map loads so like once it loads you will see that like Taj Mahal and the icon and everything so yeah it's here it says Taj Mahal if you like click it you should see the subtitle it's like freaking slow right now so yeah it like bumps up and I guess there is subtitle I don't know why it's not showing but there is a subtitle believe me guys okay okay I guess it will come up okay now 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 come on yeah it's it's here it's like one of the wonder of the world so this place is definitely Taj Mahal believe me I'm from India I know where it is so let's create a custom pin and uh, uh, at last I will show you how to like switch to satellite view so first of all let's create a custom pin I'll stop this and we need a delegate so it will be just start start typing map view and we need mk map view delegate and we will assign our map view delegate so it will be map view dot delegate equal to self so this view controller and we need to override uh, we need to use our delegate function so which is just start typing map view uh, after view did load and you will see this one so map view uh, view for annotation and its return value will be mk annotation view just hit enter and so we basically need to return a mk annotation view so under code just say let annotation view equal to mk annotation view and open parentheses and you will see this option with annotation and reuse identifier so just hit enter annotation will be our pin so the pin we created in view did load and reusable string will be let's say Taj pin okay and we just need to assign this annotation view uh, an image so image will be UI image open brackets and it will be named so let's say name and name was if you recall so Taj dos uh, hyphen Mahal I guess make sure it's same otherwise uh, you won't see the picture and just return this annotation pin return annotation pin oh it's annotation view sorry guys uh, let's run the application again 
and I guess you will see the pin so okay if you remember we downloaded image file in 512 so this image is like so freaking big so you will think that let's download the image in a uh, smaller resolution but if you do that your image will be like tearing you will be seeing pixelations on iPhone X definitely on iPhone X so let's just scale this picture down so uh, first of all after image is assigned just say let transform equal to CG affine transform and open brackets and we will say scale X and uh, Y so this will be 0 0.1 and scale Y will be 0 0.1 as well and after this just say annotation view dot transform equal to transform and run the application again so this time you will see a, a quite smaller picture so if you like uh, are not satisfied the with the picture size uh, picture size then you can just play around with this numbers you will get your uh, fit so the picture is small i like this size you know that's 0 0.1 and uh, the map is loading it's like really slow on this uh, simulator so you can just like import this application on your phone and test it out so here is the Taj Mahal created by like uh, Apple map and this is our Taj Mahal if you zoom in the picture still remains crisp so no actually picture won't change its size anyways uh, the map will be something which will zoom in so let's try to zoom in uh, if you press options on your Mac uh, you can get this two finger simulator thing so click and drag it will zoom in the response time is uh, really slow on this simulator as I told you before so let's quickly uh, see how to get satellite view so stop the application so under map view dot delegate say map view dot map type and equal to and just hit dot and you will see all the options so like there are a bunch of options I guess there are six options so just say satellite and run the application again and this time uh, we should see satellite view of Taj Mahal and uh, okay it's here I guess it's dark okay it's here so we can see the top view of Taj Mahal and here is our icon so we can actually place multiple annotation pins over the map view so I will be creating a whole another video for that so that's how you create a custom annotation pin and if you have any questions post them in comments if you like my video just thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe for future videos